You are watching Current Updates, episode Sunday, January the 2nd, 2011 2230 The wife of the Stockholm suicide bomber said she had no idea he had become radicalized and was plotting a terror attack, in an interview out Sunday. The United Nations said it will do everything it can to locate areas where human rights abuses have allegedly occurred in Ivory Coast following disputed presidential elections. Time.com, according to Europol, attacks by far-left and anarchist groups jumped dramatically between 2008 and 2009, as militants take advantage of public anger over economic woes. Time.com, the Latin American nation has the second largest population of internally displaced people in the world. How the new president intends to change that? Investigators found a body Saturday night in a San Diego County house destroyed by fire, after a man called 911 saying he was going to shoot his wife and himself, authorities said. Three people, including two small children, died in a Saturday morning fire that consumed their northeast Iowa trailer home, authorities said. Four students who posed for photos with a human placenta have been kicked out of a suburban Kansas City nursing program after a placenta pictures was posted on Facebook. I love worst of the year articles. So let us now eschew all the good things from 2010 like winter's bone and a bad porn and spend some time wallowing in sheer suck. Patrick Sauer recently attended a viewing of the first ever NBA telecast on ESPN's new 3D channel and it was a glimpse into our strange future, floating heads, precision celebrity high fives, and lots and lots of really unreal detail. Mark Ingram ran for two scores to break the Alabama career touchdown record, and the no. 15 Crimson Tide rolled past 7th ranked Michigan State 49-7 on Saturday in the most lopsided Capital One Bowl in history. Chris Roth threw three touchdown passes. Vic Ballard ran for three scores and no. 21 Mississippi State overwhelmed Michigan 52-14 Saturday in the Gator Bowl. That was all for Current Updates episode Sunday, January 2, 2011 22.30 and 9 seconds Indonesia, Jakarta. Thank you for using News Anchor.